99.9. I'm going to start him on ceftriaxone. Good catch. I might have missed that. It's not gonorrhea. I didn't say it was. Not out loud. But you're figuring that joint pain plus fever plus a low lifestyle equals a set triaxone prescription. So you're saying I got the clap? I've only been in here one week. My girlfriend's clean. I ain't got a girlfriend in here. How do you know about Seth triaxone? House used to be a doctor. Not going back. And that look of shock is elitist and offensive. Doctors can be degenerates. This is America. A subtle eyebrow loss. It's lupus. Oh, there's no discoid or malar rash on his face. Which would be dispositive if he was just a giant head. He's got a point. Well, uh, I'll let you make the call. No, there's no reason to search for a bodily rash since lupus doesn't usually present that way. Usually? Well, I guess that's good enough for prison work. You don't write people up for mouthing off, do you? <laughs> Not usually. Hey, take off your shirt so I can find the rash. Well, now you want to help me? Because that doctor didn't believe you? Well, if you could think of a better way to prove that she's an idiot, I'm all ears. Well, let's get this over with. That's Nicole. She lives at her mom's now on account that she lost her job. And her mom hates me, so. She can't visit. She ain't accepting my calls. That's what happens when you date a 12-year-old. You don't believe me? Belief implies a level of giving a crap that I am never gonna achieve. Pull down your pants. <laughs> what happened? I'm trying to use the phone, I just, I just got jostled a little bit. Who hit you? Just bumped into the wall. It's not lupus. Is, is that good? Does it feel good? Now try an inch to the left. Hear the difference? It's called an acoustical shadow. It means he's got a tumor. How did you find that without a stethoscope? I didn't even know you could do this. Start the blood thinners. So I for sure got lung cancer? No. Yeah. All you've proven is there's an anomaly in his chest. Which means your initial diagnosis could still be right. Which apparently really bugs you. I could do a clotting test. Good idea. We're just gonna cut your earlobe a bit and check back in two minutes. If there's a little blood bubbling up, that's normal. But if it's completely clotted, it may indicate cancer. Okay? Are you really leaving medicine? What are you gonna do? You know, for someone who asks as many favors as you do, you sure don't make any effort to win me over. Before I went to med school, I thought about getting a PhD in physics. You ever heard of dark matter? The way galaxies rotate in motion of the universe it means there's six times more stuff than we can detect. It's been theorized, but no one's ever proved it exists. So, uh, so you want to research it? Why? It's the greatest mystery there is. Theory of everything. And completely divorced from humanity. Well, me and humanity, we got together too young. 
You have a gift. There is something in this world you are undeniably great at. You can read people. You, you understand them. You, you gotta go back to medicine. Well, if that gift is related to what brought me here, you'll understand. I want to check the returns policy. Hey, is this supposed to happen? Lips are swollen. Open your mouth. Did you just eat something? Meatloaf, potatoes, coffee. You're allergic to anything? <laughs> Guard! Going in anaphylactic shock. Guard! Damn it. I gotta make a hole so you can breathe. Get away from him! He's having an allergic reaction. He can't breathe. Lie on the ground with your hands behind your head. Alvarez, look at what I'm doing! It's a tracheotomy. Come on, man. You know I'm a doctor. <laughs> What's wrong with him? I have no idea. It was the heat. It's mastocytosis. It can be set off by hot liquids like the coffee he just drank. Masto is usually a skin disease. Usually? It can hit any organ. Joint pain, osteopenia, and anaphylaxis, eyebrow loss. It fits. That's a possibility. I'll run some blood tests. Thank you. No, no. It's almost impossible to confirm Masto with blood work. Let's give him five aspirin. If he has Masto, he'll go into anaphylactic shock and won't be able to breathe again. You do understand the meaning of the word confirm. I'll do it. I almost died in that cell. House. You're in here because you think you can do whatever you want, whenever you want. You can't. And neither can I. The ACLU would have my job, my license, maybe even my house if I do an unauthorized experimental... Yeah, if, if it is Masto... It's not. Well, then what do you have to lose by giving him the aspirin? I'm not taking the risk. It's his risk to take. If he has another attack and there isn't a doctor in the next cell, he could die. So for one second, will you stop covering your ass and do the test? I think House is right. No. You're a moron and a coward. I'll do it myself. Guard! You're done here. Just like every other place you've ever set foot in your life. If I ever see you in here again, I will write you up and they will revoke your parole. Where's the aspirin? Did you get beaten up on purpose? House, what are you doing? Hey! House, open up! This is a direct order! It's always a direct order. Eight months, I haven't heard an indirect order in here. Dr. Adams! They're gonna revoke your parole. They're gonna charge you with extra crimes. You'll be here six more months, minimum. Sorry, I distracted. You were saying? I checked your file. You didn't have a bad lawyer. You had no lawyer. You took the first deal they offered you because you wanted to punish yourself. You think getting beaten up, you think saving this one guy will wipe your slate clean? No. Then why are you doing this? Because I have a gift. Once you drink this, you should get an attack almost immediately. That is, if I'm right. You just spot yourself months in solitary. Was it really worth it? If I'm wrong, no, it wasn't. No, 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 get the cup, get the cup. Just drink it, drink it. No, grab the cup. What were you thinking? I don't know. I, I, I was, I was scared. No! You're fired. No, you're beyond fired. You're completely unhirable anywhere. You understand that? Yes. Now shut up and let's see if he has an attack. Let's go. 
Come on, just a little more time. Get him out of here. 